Hello everybody. Hello everybody, back again with a new project. This is again PWM uh, wave, pulse with modulation. Um, what I did, <coughs> I've added a, an LED here so that uh, it does move according to the uh, the wave that moves. Um, I I set the the wavelengths uh, longer and uh, the amplitude also larger so that it doesn't get too close. Uh, but you can see <coughs> we can adjust it. Okay, so hello, hello, hello. Okay, now it should be. The light can give you indication when it works better. Okay, let's try now. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, and then the wave moved differently. And the LED lights up. Stop talking, and when you talk, it comes up again. Okay. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so that works. So... <coughs> this is, I'm not going to try music again, but uh, yeah, and you can see how the the LED lit up, <coughs> let me explain what I've done here, alright, so <coughs> the, um, the uh, OLED is connected to pin number 7 SDA and pin number 6, that one there, 7 and 6, SDA and SEL, okay, and then I made a railing here, positive, negative, okay, this is 3.3 .3 volt, because the uh, the uh, the sound sensor works on 3.3 .3 volt, not necessarily can work with fire, but uh, here, uh, because it's analog, it's uh, ADC, analog convert to digital, Okay, so and also grounded here uh, on the railing and the 3.3 .3 volt. Uh, the OLED, uh, I've set it up here on this other side because it's 5 volt, all right. And then I put uh, an LED on the uh, pin number 5, which is been set for PWM and a resistor which is grounded 10k no sorry 3.3 .3, 3, uh, 2, 220 to 330 3, 3 ohm and goes on the on the on the shorter leg which of the LED and the longer leg goes to pin number five there we are pretty simple and this is the way it works and you can see the wave and it's a PW, as you see here. Okay, it's a level. Right. And here are the codes. All right, which I will post on your tube. <coughs> you can do changes yourself for the amplitude and the wavelengths and the uh, the speed. I'll put explanation here and you can change this various item here, uh, smooth level, constraint and so on and you can change them to bring them, you know, as I did. So you can change, this is a millisecond all right and you can have it faster or slower i like it slower because it's uh it makes it look more interesting all right this is the one that you can change okay the 255 10 40 and 30 25 okay you can change this one to make them um, uh, shorter amplitude you know the wave amplitude and you can make it uh, the 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 wavelengths longer or shorter okay so and this time offset millisecond it's 
create a movement and this will be the speed. Right. So these are the most important uh, of to change the setting. And I put here Let me see where did I put it, oh, there are some, but I will have an explanation as well. So uh, in this case, if I, w you know, uh, on your case, you, you're going to play, tr uh, try, try an error uh, to set your, which one you prefer, how do you prefer the waves, you know. So I'm happy with the what I've set up like this, which are smooth, and yeah, you, you can, make it different way, but I, I like them like that. Hello, 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 one, two, three, one, two, three, can you hear me? One, two, three, that's the way it works. You see some more settings. <coughs> hello. Hello, hello, yeah, yeah, okay guys, have a good Monday and uh, please give me a thumbs up if you like it, thank you, ciao, bye.